Hello again. I was just having some thoughts running through my head, so I thought I would make another video. So in today's video, uh, we are talking about medical issues and medications that put people at risk for obesity. I've noticed when dealing with these fat positive, fat acceptance folks, if I say that obesity is unhealthy, you'll get these people who will immediately jump to, oh, but some people have medical conditions. And yes, it's true that there are people who have medical conditions or medications that put them at risk for obesity. Now, a couple of things. Um, that is the minority of the population, okay? Most obese people don't have thyroid issues or any of this other stuff. And also, even if you do have these medical conditions that put you at risk for obesity, you still can control what you put in your mouth. Now, I understand that there are going to be people with certain dietary restrictions because of their medical issues. I get that. But again... That's going to be a minority of the population. And, you know, I used to have this uh, roommate who was taking Seroquel, which, is, which, puts you, which makes people fat. And she definitely was obese. But she also had a crap diet and she smoked. One example that was just said quite a lot. Uh, a friend of mine was visiting... And the roommate says to my friend, if I give you my food stamp card, will you go buy me some ice cream? And to give you some context, the roommate did not have a car, and it was late enough that I think the buses had stopped running. So if she wanted to go get the ice cream, her option was to go walk. And... It was, you know, not the, the grocery store was not the closest. It wasn't like just like right down the block, but it wasn't super far away. And she was just too fat and out of shape to be able just to go like walk down to the goddamn store. And so you, that says a whole lot, that says quite a lot about this issue. You know, yeah, she was taking a medication that put her at risk for obesity, but she was also eating crap and not getting any exercise. And it's interesting how when you bring up that obesity is unhealthy, immediately you get these fat acceptance folks who automatically want to go towards the outliers. They go to the minorities. Oh, yeah, but some people have medical conditions. It's like they want to just excuse people being obese. It's just, it's kind of amazing. And it's like, okay, sure, there are people with thyroid issues and whatever. That doesn't change the fact that most people don't have this issue and most people can get their weight down if they choose. So why the fuck are you bringing up the outliers? Why are you bringing up the minority when what I am saying is applicable to the vast majority of people? It's just... And also, when they, when they bring this stuff up, they want to act like, like you're a bad person, right? Because it's like... It's like... It's like you should, oh, you should have compassion for these people who, who are fat and they can't do anything about it. It's like, and sure, I do. But again, that's not the vast majority of people. The vast majority of people are able to lose weight, okay? I don't have a fucking thyroid problem. My problem was the same problem that most obese people have. Too many fucking calories. You know, and I got this comment from one of these fat acceptance folks. Well, you don't know why people are fat. And I may not know the individual circumstances that contributed to the person's obesity, but I do know why they're fat. It's because of too many fucking calories. It's really quite that simple. 
you know, I don't know what sort of emotional issues they've got or eating disorders or any of that stuff. But I do know that what actually made them obese is too many fucking calories. It's really quite that simple. So, so yeah, stop using medical conditions and side effects of medications as an excuse. Bringing that shit up in no way nullifies anything I've said. Obesity is still unhealthy. And it doesn't change the fact that most people can do something about their obesity if they really, really want to. Okay? Okay? So stop it with the whole methyroid crap. It's bullshit. Okay? It is a bullshit excuse used to justify people leading unhealthy lifestyles. And you're going to get impressionable people that are going to see this and and are going to get this mentality of, well, I guess there's nothing I can do about about my weight. And then they're just going to happily stuff their face with junk food, thinking that there's nothing they can do about it. And that is not the message that we want to be promoting. We want to be promoting this message that, yes, you can do something about your weight. And yes... You might have certain issues that make it harder for you to lose weight, but that doesn't mean you can't. You're just going to have to work at it harder than other people. So, yes, that was my little my little piece that I, on that because I was just thinking about that particular issue. So, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and subscribe and all that stuff. And my comments are open, so please go ahead and comment and let's have some productive discussion in the comments and if there are any fat acceptance folks watching please comment i want to hear your opinion on the matter too and so thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one